Oh shit! You're odd, you're odd. Hey, 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 Pretty much everything you need is here right in front of me. You'll need anything from a litre between two to five pound. Will be more than enough. And then any type of micro soft plastic, anything like this will work. You can pick these up at a JDM shop. Typically they stock them. And um, these are the jig heads you'll need. Just real micro. Look how small that is. Yeah, I'll show you how to rig up. Typically, you don't need any fancy knots to tie on the leader. I'll just do a double uni. Obviously, you're only fighting bait fish, really, so any knot will do. Anything you're comfortable tying will work. Outfit of choice today is just a 2000 size drill and a 2-6 to six kilo rod. I mean, probably a little heavy, but it'll work anyway. All right, once you've got your leader tied on, Pretty much you tie it on as if you were tying on any other soft plastic, you just tie on your jig head. I like to use a loop knot, no particular reason, it's just what I'm used to tying. When you tie on your leader, you know, tie on a meter, meter half, because typically, I mean, you're not going to get busted usually, but the only chances of getting cut off is uh, with the tailor, because if there's yakas around, there's typically tailor around as well, so be mindful of that. So just leave a bit of excessive uh, leader before you cut it off from the roll, because um, yeah, otherwise you'll have to tie a whole new leader on later, which is annoying, so you prefer to be proactive than uh, have to worry about it later. Once you've got the jig head on, go ahead and um, get one of these soft plastics out so once you've got it rigged up it should just look like that just a perfect little worm imitation and um, let's start throwing at them put my shit away I'm local to the wharf probably recognizes this guy <laughs> the OG he's always here he knows what he's doing So you just want to cast and um, just retrieve it off the top and you should see them chase it and it's only a matter of time they'll, they'll eat it. And getting follows. Just switch off the retrieve till they actually bite so try slow, try fast. Wow. Fuck. You saw that one. Keep persisting, they'll start hitting eventually. And yakas turn on and off throughout the night, it's pretty common, so then be discouraged if they're not biting straight away. There it is. I just let it sink that time. Finally got one. Now you might be curious as to why would you throw soft plastics for these? Well, there's a lot of reasons. A, it's more fun. B, you're not going to get dirty. And C, you can have these jig heads and soft plastics ready to go at any given time. You don't have to run past the servo to pick up any pilchards or, you know, put chicken aside that night for bait or whatever the case. You know, this was a last minute thing and sure enough I'm here. I haven't had to stop anywhere on the way to get bait. For people just getting into like soft plastics and that it's a good way to to like you know get a bit of confidence in what you're doing and learn new retrieves and stuff just like that
just want to take your time with them because they have really light lips but this is a massive yakka big yakka I've never even fished off a beach for Joey. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was telling him before. <laughs> I wish <laughs> Too big <laughs> I think I might be on a flathead or some shit. That looks weird, bro. I'm just gonna leave it. And it had a live bait about that size, so. Mm. Like that sinker. Oh, shit! Your, your rod, bro, your rod. That's you, hey, Michael. That's you. you deserve it, bro. Fuck yeah. Yeah, we should bring our lines in, eh? Do you got a net, bruv? Yeah? All right, get it ready. Big? It's okay. Should be legal? Hopefully. I don't think so. Unless you got it like really, really light. No. Oh yeah, that's 80 all day. Fuck yeah bro, nice. He's a good fish. Slowly but steady. We got all night, bro. It doesn't matter. Oh, <laughs> that's a big boy, man. Oh, he's a good, he's a good one, bro. Uh, take your time here, because this net, I don't trust it. No offense. <laughs> so. Now I'm I'm all good to net it, but I'm just saying this net's probably not the most ideal net for that fish. No. But that's alright. He's not ready. <clears throat> oh fuck! I knew it wasn't ready for it. <laughs> First net. Yeah, he's legal all day, bro. Legal is good. Do you want? We, I've got a brag mat. If you want to put him on the brag mat. What do you reckon? Is it? He's eighty on the dot. Yeah, eighty on the dot. Mm, <laughs> well done. He's drunk. <laughs> He's a beautiful fish, man. All goes above. You got it on camera as well. 
<laughs> you want me to send you the footage? Do you want me to send you the footage? That's a beautiful fish, bro. Congrats, Michael. Let's crack off.